Northam is a special company. We are a mining company essentially that mines very, very special metals, green metals, platinum and palladium. We believe in our people, we believe in our product, we believe in our country. I live my life, sip my tie slowly, some island vibes with tender bullies. So for many years, before the new dispensation in South Africa, the majority of the population were prevented from owning homes, they were prevented from owning land. If you look in the South African context over many, many, many years, it's part of this legacy of mining. You had migratory labor. People leave their families behind from wherever they come from. And they basically work, live in a two people, three people room, and then so it repeats year in, year out. My name is Unity Shibori. I'm a ship supervisor at Northern Boys and Dal Mine. My typical working day starts with the handover with my big shift school. I take from them what happened on their shift, and then from there I have to plan my task for the day. I have to organize my labor, my machinery, and then I have to go underground to supervise the people, make sure that they're working to standards, and then they're working towards achieving our goals that we planned on surface. As Northern, we wanted to move away from the past and move into a new era. And part of moving into that new era was providing housing, providing home ownership for our employees. So we started building houses in developments for our employees. We started seeing that if you really want to stop legacy issues, you need to pave the way for them to get an entrance into owning property. What we as Northern saw is an opportunity for us to, one, contribute to the broader housing delivery in the country, as well as provide housing for our employees um, and giving them the opportunity to buy a home for the first time. The mining housing project offer, it comes with the fact that I'm owning the house to my name. With other mining houses where I worked before, we know the mines, you have to stay there, but when you leave, it's no longer your house. But with this one, it is my house. From the moment I'm done with the application, everything it is in my name. One of the benefits is that our employees are given the house at cost, whereas individuals who are purchasing on the open market will pay much higher than what our employees uh, are paying. And so what that does on day one is it already just lifts up the value of the property that our employees have, uh, have bought. Now compared to where I was staying, I'm saving about 3,000 rand. I'm owning a house which is less than 5,000 rand a month. So it, it's really helping me to save. You can't just build wealth by not owning at least something such as property in your name. And I think for us, it really comes to, we really want our people to feel that they, they can create wealth. Coming home after a long day to a home where I'll just relax, play with my kids, it's such a great feeling. It was also about our employees getting the opportunity, some for the first time, to live together as a family. People come from all over to work on our mining operations. Northwest, Limpopo, Natal, Gauteng. Some of them, during their leave, go home. Um, that's the only time they get to see their families. So for us, one of the elements of our accommodation strategy was to ensure that our employees get the opportunity to live with their families. And therefore, the homes that we built are two and three bedroom homes that facilitate and allow for our employees to live with, uh, with their families. We made sure that the land that we purchase is close to schools, it's close to shops, um, it's close to amenities that anyone else would have access to. The whole northern aspect of how we do our business and how we look at our people is not just the housing. The housing makes you obviously feel very good. To see the difference you make in people's life makes you feel good. But northern story is not just about the housing. We 
have created an organization that only had 10,000 people in 2010 employed. And today we're sitting with 18,300 people employed. And it's not temporary employment, it's meaningful, proper jobs. The initial idea around home ownership is it was a tool to retain employees and a tool to attract employees who wanted homes. We've done it because it makes good business sense. As a company, if you have a person, he's happy, his family is happy, his kids are happy in the school, he's not going to leave you as a business. He wants to work for you. He wants to remain with you. You're attracting other people working for other companies that also wants to come and work for you. So it's a hugely mutual, beneficial, uh, we get proper employees that wants to work for us and we want them to work for us and we want them to feel that they're not just a person or as a payroll number, they're employee individual, a contributor to the bigger objectives of Norway. That's the objective. We want people to want to keep on working for us because at the end of the day, we can only function if there's good people working for us in our operations. If we don't look after the areas in which, in which we operate, we are destroying our future as a, as a company. And so with all these housing developments that we are putting up in the various towns where we operate, we have to ensure that there's a partnership between our mining operations and the local municipalities. As soon as the property sector picks up and there's people selling and buying properties, it helps with what the activity is all about in the town. It helps with the secondary business, it's the shops. Uh, my name is Clement Mashejo. I'm a manager for roads and stormwater at the municipality. The private and public partnership will still assist this town greatly because we face different challenges. But when we come together, we, we build a nice infrastructure that will impact on the socio-economic challenges of the town. Northern Platinum has assisted us in, in, in building the Potkitter Street, which is now refurbished. It is in a good condition. There is now investment. There is a restaurant built along that, that road. As Northern, we have built clinics to service the community. Those clinics have since been handed over to the Department of Health. The clinic make huge difference to our community because we were traveling about 45 kilometers from our village to the first clinic at town. Especially the clinic have maternity room. When a woman around here is supposed to deliver, then it becomes a challenge up until they deliver along the road before they reach at Leidenberg. It brings huge impact and huge difference to our communities. Yeah, this little clinic has helped for us and all the community for this. And the second name is the men's hospital to go to another clinic to go to another clinic. And we have to transport it, but not transport. We have to go to another transport, but we have to go to another clinic. And this clinic is also better than we have to go to another clinic. Yeah. The house has changed my life in so many ways. I have a place where my kids can play with me any time of the day. I love plants, so now I have the ground of my own way. I can um, plant my own trees, I can plant my own flowers. So whatever I'm doing, I know that it's permanently going to be mine. I'm making my own mark in my own house. My name is Tao Chweni. Uh, this is my wife, it's Valencia Trini. I'm a Scofi at Boysen style. Uh, this project changed our life. Uh, I'm currently staying with my wife and my two kids, which was actually not easy before. I think for me, um, the housing project has actually done an amazing changes in our lives. Owning your own house, staying with my husband, staying with my kids, it's such an amazing experience. Where I used to live before, my kids were not safe. But in this 
complex. My children are safe and we've got enough space, not even mentioning outside the yard, inside the com uh, complex, where they can ride their bicycles and all. It is safe and then it is, it is quiet. We've made friends, good friends for that matter, and the houses are very cheap. So for us, it's quite an amazing achievement, staying with your own kids, staying with your family. So we're actually quite happy. I'm owning this home. Imagine, I never thought of owning a home like this. I would not work for any other company. I think that as we're getting a younger group of people that are coming into to the workforce, it'll give me great joy to see young people get on that property ladder with the assistance of Northern Platinum. So our housing and accommodation strategy is about changing people's lives, is about making people's lives better. And I think for us, it's special. It's special to do the metals and it's special to work with people and it's special to change lives.